हेलो तो क्या मैं दिखाई दे रहा दे, दे पा रहा हूँ आप बता दो यार ऐसा लाइव में क, कभी किसी के साथ आया नहीं हूँ पहली बार आ रहा हूँ शायद तो भाई अगर आपको मेरी आवाज अच्छे से आ रही हो तो प्लीज बता दीजिएगा और त्रिमान रणवीर बहुत जल्दी जुड़ जाएंगे हमसे ठीक है तो हम फिर आगे बातें करेंगे आपके भी कुछ सवाल रहेंगे त्रिमान रणवीर से तो वो भी आप आ, पूछ सकते हैं ठीक है और जो कुछ भी आपको लगे बिल्कुल आपका आपका अपना चैनल है आपको जो लगे जिससे सवाल लगे पूछिएगा ठीक है आ, बस एक चीज की है आशा की लाइट ना चली जाए ठीक है क्योंकि आज है संडे और संडे को बिजली वालों से मतलब उनको बड़ी प्रॉब्लम होती है हमसे हाँ लव यू मेरे भाई थैंक यू थैंक यू सो मच भाई देव माल्या थैंक यू सो मच चलो अभी त्रिमान रणवीर कब जुड़ते देखते हैं और आई होप कि ज्यादा से ज्यादा लोग हमारे लाइव स्ट्रीम में आ पाए ताकि सभी के जो बातें हैं सभी की जो थॉट्स है सभी की जो जो क्वेश्चन है वो सब एक साथ क्लियर हो जाए तो अच्छा रहेगा ओके तो आई थिंक त्रिमान रणवीर भी जुड़ चुके हैं ओके हेलो भाई हाउ आर यू हाउ आर यू थैंक्स ब्रो थैंक यू फॉर हैविंग मी ओके सो वी आर ऑलरेडी लाइव सो पीपल आर वाचिंग यू सो वेयर आर यू नाउ इन मिनर्वा यस यस आई एम इन रणजी सर्स ऑफिस करंटली यस आई एम मिनर्वा ओके सो हाउ इज इट गोइंग Yes, yeah, going really well. Um, just getting training uh, with the Delhi FC first team and the Tech Show team, and just okay. um, yeah, preparing myself for next season in India. Okay, so everyone wants to know what is going on actually with your passport issue. So just uh, tell us everything. Yeah, um, like I shared on um, Twitter and on social media, that this hasn't been easy. um let me start from the beginning i actually went to the um, yeah like the belgium embassy uh, the indian embassy in brussels actually so i went there and they said yeah i can uh, apply for passport but say they didn't know it exactly how to apply for it because it is a not a normal situation not everybody asks for indian citizenship mostly it's other way around so yeah they were quite confused actually in the beginning but then um yeah like i explained them everything and so showed them who runs the judges and what i'm going to do i showed my profile and explained everything and yeah actually they were quite surprised and really um considered so they were really helpful and said yeah look we can apply it for you but the issue is uh, you, you it's going to take a long time and i don't have that so uh, they said this faster if you go to india meet the dc of your local district which for me was nawashar So we said go there and then uh, apply. It's going to be much faster. So we agreed and um, we bought a ticket to India. Me and my father went and um, I think it's been a week now. We went to the DC office in Nawashar and he couldn't help me. And he said um, that I that he just forwarded me through to the embassy to the um, it's called the Jalandhar passport office. Mm-hmm. Actually, we waited three days for the um, for the DC to show up. He said he's going to come here today at twelve o'clock. It wasn't there. Come later, five o'clock. It wasn't there. Next day, same story. We after three days of waiting for him, he, I, I finally showed up and just said to us, "Yeah, you have to go to them. I cannot help you." Yeah, it was disappointing, but yeah, what can we do? Then we go to the passport office, and then we arrive. Me and my father, we had to wait like three, four hours, I think. And after explaining them in the beginning that the DC office sent me, the DC sent me, and that the Indian embassy of Brussels sent me, they couldn't care less, and I also still told them. Can you please just let us ask a question? Otherwise, we are in the line for five hours for nothing. So if you're gonna give us an answer anyway, just let us go now. You know. So they said, no, no. Even for asking a question, go in the line. Okay, which I respect and I do. Uh, me and my father wait patiently in the line three hours. Then you, once you get inside, waited another hour just to get the answer that I uh, expected. Then I, uh, yeah, I asked them. He said, yeah, you have to apply for citizenship first, which probably the DC knew. He could have told me in the beginning, which he didn't. But uh, yeah, no. Uh, what can we do? But uh, yeah, um, and then I went also to apply for the to the Home Affairs. And so they directed me Embassy, uh, DC, Passport Office, Home Affairs, and then the site doesn't work. Then after um, yeah, waiting a week, then the site uh, finally worked. And then um, it says you have to be five years OCI holder to apply for citizenship. Which I personally think is nonsense because what's the difference of a person that got his OCI one year and five years? He's still an overseas citizen. Mm. I don't see any difference. 
So I, I got it now two years. I'm not going to wait three years to just to apply for citizenship. After that, I'm going to wait no, another long process for my passport. It's going to take more than five, six, seven years if I do it the normal way, yeah. which is impossible for any foreign footballer. Imagine a Premier League footballer or a professional footballer. I'm just a kid. I'm not a professional footballer. Yeah. They wouldn't even want to wait, wait six weeks. You know? So mm -hmm. let I'm I'm still patient enough to wait for a process month, two months, six months even. But I cannot wait five, six years. Then my prime is over, brother. Then it's not worth it. <laughs> this is gonna be impossible so, to play for. Me. So you know, uh, you are currently uh, like Ranjit Bajaj is working for you right now. Yes. So yes. he is a big big guy, and maybe he has some political friends also. So uh, don't you think if you go with some political people, so it will be easy for you? Yeah, I mean, um, that was, uh, that's what I'm hoping for. I hope that uh, AFFF, I know it's not only their um, say, but I hope also the Indian government. That's why in my post, I tagged all the people that I have power to do something about this. And uh, yeah, I think is he is going to help me. So um, I, I think it's, I don't know yet how it's going to turn out, but he'll also do his best on his part. I'll do my best from my part. And uh, I hope all you guys um, share this story. Like uh, I made a thread on Twitter, and um, I think I don't know how many people retweeted it. It's crazy. I'm still surprised why he didn't reply. Like you said in your tweet, it was I uh, also registered your tweet. He said that you were spot on and that he liked you. <laughs> so you tweet that you said that he applied to Jan Danda, I think in what, 50 minutes? Yeah. 50 minutes. Yeah. And my tweet got some, I think, a lot of attention, not more maybe, but uh, still a lot. I think a lot of people retweeted it. You retweeted it, you quoted it, everybody did. Somebody that I know, um, Saji follows him. He sent him a personal mm -hmm. message. He has seen it, but hasn't replied. So, yeah, what can I say? I mean, maybe there's a reason behind it. I'm not going to talk much about that, but it's just uh, kind of disappointing. Okay, let me just tell in Hindi to my all the people. Bhai, dekho, baat aise hai ki, jo Triman bhai hai, passport ke liye, office to office unko dhakke diye ja rahe उनके जो पापा है उनको लाइन में खड़ा रखा जा रहा है कि है ना तीन दिन रुको दो दिन रुको दस घंटे रुको तो ऐसा कराया जा रहा है और उनको मतलब वेट पे वेट कराया जा रहा है वो लोग ठीक है और किसी भी तरीके से कोई हेल्प नहीं आ रही है ठीक है मतलब कि ऑफिस वाले जो है वो बोल रहे हैं कि आपको पांच साल का उसी कार्ड होल्डर होना चाहिए उसके बाद आप पासपोर्ट के लिए अप्लाई कर सकते हैं तो ये आप समझ सकते हैं कि भाई अगर वो बंदा इधर ऑलरेडी आ चुका है और वो पांच साल तक अगर वेट करेगा ओसीआई कार्ड का है ना कि ओसीआई होल्डर पांच साल का समझ सकते हैं तो पांच साल तक मान लो भाई की एज 24 हो जाएगी आई थिंक 23, 24 उसके बाद तो भाई कोई साइंस ही नहीं बनता ना तब तक क्या तब तक इधर तो कुछ कर ही नहीं पाएंगे नेशनल ना कोई यूथ नेशनल टीम में खेल पाएंगे ना सीनियर में जाने का कोई चांस है तो ये जो चीज है भाई बहुत दिक्कत की बात है तो इस चीज को हमको समझना है और ऑल इंडिया फुटबॉल फेडरेशन को भाई इसमें सीधा सीधा हाथ डालना पड़ेगा कुछ पॉलिटिकल इन्फ्लुएंस इसमें लगेगा तभी हो पाएगा देखो सिंगल हैंडली आप बोलेंगे भाई त्रिमान भाई ये सब चीजें कर पाएंगे तो बहुत मुश्किल है बिकॉज वो तो भाई अभी जस्ट आया है वो किसी को जानते भी नहीं है इंडिया में तो आई होप कि जितने लोग अभी हमको सुन रहे हैं देख रहे हैं वो अब इस चीज को समझेंगे कि ये कितनी डिफिकल्ट चीज है तभी इस वजह से है ना कई लोग जो सोचते हैं कि भाई इंडिया की नेशनलिटी ले नहीं ले वो सोचते हैं देख सकते हैं आप कितनी मुश्किल है ठीक है तो आई होप की सबको समझ में आ गई होगी बात Uh, okay, so Triman, many people are saying that uh, uh, is anyone asking for money or kind of something like bribe? <laughs> no, no, not a, not that I know, <laughs> not yet. But, least, but, um... but you know, in India, if you offer some kind of money, they will uh, work for yeah, you. Yeah, of course, I, I know, I know. My father explained how India works, but um, <clears throat> still, nobody has told me that. Luckily, so uh, no issues from that point now. So, but I'm not uh, trying to get uh, my password that way. I just want to get that um, because I'm doing a lot for Indian football already by being the first European, at least, uh, coming and um, not exposing, but showing people how it is for a player from my perspective. And uh, I think a lot of, uh, if I get my password, a lot of OCI players from uh, other countries will take an uh, example. So if you're going to keep treating me like that, especially after all you... Uh, and guys behind the chair are telling me we don't want to do a citizenship, so you have to be uh, OCI, you have to come to India, apply for citizenship. So, yeah, let, let me do it then. But so I don't understand um, what they are doing. It's a bit bizarre for me, but uh, yeah. So, uh, I just want to ask like, uh, you just had an offer from Kerala Blasters. So, yes. what was that? <laughs> yeah. Um... <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, I got an offer from them um, through an agent I knew. And um, the thing is, they um, offered me to stay until the end of the season. And um, yeah, uh, first they wanted me for trials, which I wasn't uh, interested in. So I told they told me, okay, you can stay until the end of the season. We give you accommodation, we give you food, we give you everything. We get your airport pickup, everything. So I said, okay, good. Give me a contract with SAIS and um, I can stay until the end of the season. I can play the Reliance League with you guys. And that I get my um, yeah, but my flight because it's like three thousand kilometers from me. I said if you can arrange everything, I come right now and sign it. I just wanted a document which says I could stay until the end of the season. It's only three months, so I don't know why um, they didn't offer me that. Another thing that is the, what I got I heard that there's no amateur contract. There's only professional. I said okay, yeah. I, even if you make it, yeah, it doesn't make sense. And then um, I told Renji says uh, how he printed me in one second. Look on the set of the side of the IFFF amateur contract. I only wanted a paper which says I could stay until the end of the season. I think I didn't ask for much. They offered me to stay only verbally. So okay. a player coming from Europe with all with all my CV and highlights that I've sent sent to them, then going for, they wanted me for Charles with it, without saying me, they wanted me for Charles, which I didn't find professional from them at that point. But still, um, like, I would love to play for them. I still to this day would love to play for Kayla Brasek. It's my, I, like I said publicly a lot of times, it's one of my favorite clubs. Maybe the favorite because I love the Manjipada and the fan business. Like, you know, it's amazing. And um, yeah. I always told Ranjisa I want to play in front of the Yellow Sea and that I want to play for them. So I was really, really happy they even showed interest in me. And yeah, I would still love to play for them. I just, it was just like uh, for my security reason, I didn't want to go without some. Uh, yeah, security again, uh, some proof that I could stay until the end of the season. So that's the thing. So uh, right now you are playing for uh, like Delhi FC, right? Yeah, I'm training. So will, so will you uh, participate in some leagues or just you are training with them? Uh, as I don't have my Indian passport, I cannot play I-League 2. And um, okay. yeah, only way if I could play now is the Reliance uh, League which allows two OCI players in each squad. Mm -hmm. So I'm um, training now because I haven't played a game in a, in a while. And training has also been uh, an issue because of <coughs> the password situation. I had three weeks that I couldn't train. So now I'm just getting my uh, fitness back and just uh, training hard to get back what I was <laughs> once before. But uh, it won't take that long. And the level in the LFC is really good. Um, really good players like some ISL players also with ISL pass. So yeah, I can develop really good there and um, yeah, maybe find a club in the Alliance League or I'm hoping um, once the Alliance League is over, you go to the next Gen Cup and I hope one um, one of the four teams um, signs me to play uh, in the Alliance League and uh, the next Gen League, I mean. So yeah, mm -hmm. that's what the plan is. So do, uh, like I'm just thinking that what you are saying, if uh, these people will not give you passport and they will just uh, continue creating uh, problems for you. So what is your plan B if if uh, the problems will uh, like go again I mean, and again? Without a password, I'm not very much used to um, the country. I mean, then I'll be another mm -hmm. foreign signing, which, yeah, I can do, but I don't see the point of it. Uh, the, it was never my motivation to be a mm -hmm. foreign signing. And um, which club? I don't think many clubs would foreign sign a young player like me. It's mostly a designer players with a lot of experience in Europe, like two, three hundred professional games, which I don't have yet. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll probably go back to Europe then if they don't um, help me. I mean, what can I do? What would you do? And then uh, maybe after once they will give me a password, I will come straight back. But uh, it's no point of me wasting my career and sitting here without any password or any clear future. Then I go back to Europe, play there one, two, three seasons get a bit older, more mature, get more experience, then maybe come back. But uh, yeah, if they offer me a um, passport and I can play for the national team, then I will come back in one minute. I'm like, I went to the embassy. Here's my passport. I'm on the Indian. I went to the DC. I'm willing to give up my passport. What more can I do? Passport office in Zander. I, I said, here, give my, I'm going to give you my passport. Just what can more can I do? You know what I mean? So yeah, um, if they want, look, uh, Arata Izumi, I spoke with him on the phone. He said one thing which I found really, really good, and he stated really well. You are ready for India, but India is not ready for you, which I think is it's really, enough. really right. As yeah. a person who did the same thing as me, he told me it's going to be a heck of a journey. It's going to be really tough, and he really, I really appreciate that he helped helping me and just um, person who can talk to. 
So yeah, like I'm gonna say it again. I am ready for India, but India doesn't seem to be ready for me. So yeah, what can oh. I do? You know, Aratha Izumi actually got his Indian passport very late. <laughs> so, I know. So how he motivated you for this step? I mean, uh, look, he's a person with a lot of experience in Indian football, and uh, he's a professional, which I can learn a lot from. And yeah, just to have him as my contact and just to, if I ever had a question or ever need anything, knowing that he's uh, with me and supporting me is just an honor for me. And yeah, of course, uh, if I need some advice, I can contact him, like he said, and I'm just uh, really glad uh, to speak to him regularly. So you uh, haven't got any kind of mail or uh, call from All India Football Federation side? Nope, nobody. No message. So... They have seen my message, but they haven't replied anything. I don't I don't know why they are ignoring because you know I think everyone in India at the moment knows about your problem but uh, I don't know why they are not uh, like uh, trying to contradict the issue you. is the issue is it's contradictory you know they say mm -hmm. one thing but then when it comes like they said yeah don't we don't want to do citizenship you have to be Indian I want to be Indian they don't allow me this they, they told to do this they, they um, inspired people yeah you need to apply citizenship when somebody actually does they treat me like this. So, yeah, what can we do? You know, what we can do, like, uh, I can request to all my, like, subscribers, audience, and all the Indian football fans, if we, everyone, uh, we should, like, we should uh, send an email to AFF regarding a problem. We should, everyone tweet regarding your problem. So, yeah. it will be like, it, we should create a trending in India, your topic. Let, let, let's uh, make a let's let's make a shared post or something on Instagram or something like that. Let's make a shared post and let's get that uh, people to, on with the issue. I'm also uh, got some fans. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I got fans uh, lately. They said they want to make a petition, which is also in the making. Just um, if you guys, I'll make a post about it. And if you get your signature, it's gonna help a lot. So yeah, we just have to spread the word, and they have to reply. They don't think they have a choice. It's not about me. I mean, it's not about me. It's for all overseas citizens. Yeah. yeah. If, right. Look, it's not. I'm not doing it for a meeting. A lot of people are saying I'm doing this for PR. But look, it's about all foreign Indian players. So if how they treat me, why would they come? So yeah, I'm just um, doing my best, and hopefully they uh, help me. Yeah, I just want to clear this thing also. Like many people are saying, like Dhanraj is doing PR of Triman Ranveer and all things. So I just want to clear, bhai, dekho, main, uh, Triman Ranveer bhai ki PR kabhi kara nahi, kabhi kisi ki bhi nahi karta. Uh, Triman bhai hai, wo India mein, India mein khilna chahate hai. Dekho, India se khilenge ki nahi, wo unka potential pe depend karta hai, unka game pe depend karta hai. Lekin, agar koi insaan Belgium chhoad ke India aara hai, agar yaan pe khilna chah raha hai, to yeh hamara first banta hai as an Indian, ki hum unki kitni help kar sakte hai. Ab help karne ko log PR samajte hai. To Twitter pe mein dekhta hoon, kai, uh, यहां पर भी कमेंट करते हैं कि भाई पीआर कर रहे हैं पीआर करना एक डिफरेंट थिंग होती है त्रिमान रणवीर भाई मुझे पैसे दे और बोले कि भाई आप मेरी बारे में खूब बड़ा चढ़ा के बोलो या मैं मुझे रोस्ट करो ताकि मैं फेमस हूं लोग मुझे जाने उसको कहते हैं पीआर दिस इज नॉट पीआर की वी आर टॉकिंग वी आर डिस्कसिंग इंडियन फुटबॉल वी आर ट्राइंग टू है ना ब्रिंग फॉरेन प्लेयर्स जो इंडियन ओरिजिन के प्लेयर्स हैं और ऐसी चीजों को पीआर करना ना बोले और जो भी ऐसा सोचते हैं उनको आप भाई थोड़ा सा अकल दें उनको थोड़ा सा ना ये चीजें समझाएं यही मैं चाहता हूं uh so triman uh, okay so if anybody wants to ask any question to triman please uh, write your questions so we can talk can about I, that. where can i see the chat because i can't see the chat i think is that available? You, <laughs> i think you cannot see the chats i think i can yeah. see the chats <laughs> no, most okay, of but I, um, yeah okay i'll yeah. highlight if anyone will ask any question ha bhai question ho to bhai puch lo yaar fir bolte ho ki bhai triman se how many viewers lo. actually i can see how many right viewers now are... 265 viewers are watching uh jin jin handes ke wo retweet karenge aapko ha bhai okay okay i will tweet and you guys need to retweet okay or i will write an email also and i will uh, copy paste it aur sabko main bataunga so you need to just you know copy paste it and email to ff like I need more than thousand emails to AFF, then their email box will hang. <laughs> so then they yeah, will reply. Like, like I said, um, let's make a shared post, something on Instagram. Let's make a shared post about this topic and let's everybody uh, repost yeah. that one. Uh, okay. Yeah. 
and the other fuel head is over. Okay, someone has asked a question. Okay, yes, if you will get Indian citizenship, what will be your first destination or first club? Um, not sure yet which one offers me uh, the best contract. <laughs> no, I mean, um, <laughs> I'll have to decide once um, I get that password, which is a long way to go. So I'm not really thinking about um, clubs right now. I just really want to play football, actually. I haven't played a game in a while. Just um, focus on my training right now. And um, yeah, getting used to the Indian football, which is completely different than what I'm used to. So it also takes some time. But yeah, once I um, get my citizenship and passport and everything, then I'll see which team is best uh, fitting for me and where I will get my minutes, which is my, my main drive. Okay. Uh, by any more questions, please. Uh... I have a question of the Puchlo, Fir Bolto, Gifir, a Triman Haiko will love, Triman Haiko will love Puchinira. Nice sublo, okay, Triman, uh, everyone, is, everyone is supporting you, I think. Okay, you can see. Thank you, thank you. I see Spun. Okay, this is uh, not a good question, but uh, okay, I'll I'll not take it. Thanks someone... for that. It was a, give, give, show me, show me. I'm, I'm <laughs> someone, is, someone is asking me. <laughs> okay. Bro, you came to India for followers, so you want to play? <laughs> yeah. It's a stupid question. I'm gonna be honest because um, if I really just came for followers, I could have buy followers. So I don't came for followers, brother. I really wanted to play for India. Okay, this is a, a good question. Uh, you can uh, you can answer him. I mean, which player doesn't want to play for the country? Um, it has also always been my dream, and uh, I see India, India as my country, as equally as Belgium. So, uh, if I could play for my country where my father and mother are from, and make them proud, which I always uh, said, yeah, they explain me. Look, you were born in uh, Belgium, of course you're Belgium, but in our blood, there's always always India, and it will remain India. And um, it, but India will always remain our home. And um, yeah, I just wanted to play for my country. I started watching Indian national team games. And uh, yeah, I was really motivated to see better days for India because a lot of times in, here in Belgium, even, they ask, everybody talks about their country, like Belgium guys like me, but with other descent, they talk about their team, Americans, African players from their country. And yeah, they said, do India even have a team? They don't even know if India has a football team. And yeah, they tell India is not good and everything. Huh? Never seen a play. Do you even have good players? And then I just want to, um, that stereotype, I want to be gone because India is as well a sporting uh, nation as other countries. I mean, hockey, we are champions. I think badminton, we are also good champions. I think also in tennis, we are champions. Cricket, we are champions. Quaddy, we are champions. I think we are really capable of greatness. And I think. It's just bizarre why we are lacking so much in football. And uh, look, I, I like uh, cricket a lot. And cricket has seen a lot of glory days, but I think we should, as a country, really focus on football, which is really behind. So that's my motivation to uh, play for India. Okay, uh, one more good question. I have to, um, I have a lot of things to do here personally. Um, I, I could do that, but I think uh, me being here in presence has um, a lot to do with it. And I also get a good level training here with the LFC. So, um, yeah, I think if I go abroad and again, the process will take a long time. Even when I'm here, it's going to take a long time. Imagine me going to Europe. So how long is got that going to take? You know what I mean? And um, yeah, I think I have to be here to uh, make something work. Then I could have stayed in Europe and never come to India and just apply online, which everybody can do, but which I don't see the point in. So. Yeah, I really wanted to come in India. Okay, okay. Chinmay has one question. Triman, do you feel confident enough to the Indian climate for game? Um, not. I mean, com not completely. Still different because in Europe it was much colder <laughs> than here. So I mean, uh, yeah, not Europe. I mean, Belgium, especially Holland, is more. But I still have to take some time because the weather is. It was not that hot a month ago, but now it's being not more and more heat, so it's more difficult. 
But yeah, I mean, it takes time for everybody. And like I said before, I think it's equally as difficult for an Indian player going to Europe and then for an European going to India. I mean, so that's a really underrated thing. And not a lot of people understand. They think you're coming from Europe, you're going to be at the best directly. I think it's also a process for me. I'm still 18 years old, so I have to learn a lot. And I'm not saying I'm the best, but I have potential, which I do. I know I have. So it will take some time and just hard work and training will get me where I belong. Okay, so can you understand Hindi question? <laughs> um, if you can read, I try. I understand Hindi, but I cannot speak it. Okay, try Bro, this one. Infrastructure kaise lag? Bro, apko India ka infrastructure kaise lag? I mean, do they have an infrastructure? That's the problem. <laughs> I don't see much of infrastructure, to be honest. I I think if you go to Belgium and I think you even been to Russia, I think it's not. I think they have much better infrastructure than here. And uh, European countries, uh, the more so, uh, they're lacking on infrastructure-wise, not football-wise also. But I mean, the whole country is uh, kind of a mess. But I think it's also much bigger than other countries. But I don't think that's an excuse because you have much bigger countries than India that also well organized. So yeah, what can we say? Okay, Amal. Amal has one question: How much the gap in the level of football between the game he played in Belgium and with Minerva Trent? Um, I, mm, mm, there's a difference between Minerva and Delhi FC. Delhi FC are like older guys, experienced guys that play in the ISL, and I mean Minerva are like the, the youth players, which I haven't played a lot with, but still there's of course a difference. But um, for me, it wasn't that easy because I playing with the Delhi FC because I never played senior or I played few games with senior players, so it wasn't like uh, it was going to be easy for me. I thought, yeah, I have to be the best in training, then I'm going to be good. But then the reducer sat me down and explained me, look, you're playing against this player, you're going to play against this player. He played for Mohan and he played for this and this. And you're holding yourself up and you, from day one, you're capable to play at that level, which is just socially, you have potential, you know. And playing against players that played for uh, Round Gospel Job, players that played for Hyderabad or something like that, you know. And for me being at day one, after playing not that long and just being able to hold myself up against those players, it shows I can be capable of doing better things in the future. And uh, when I'm older, a bit stronger and uh, smarter and uh, and developed as a player, I have some potential and I'll be able to play that level. Okay, let me... Uh, how you... So people are calling you next Sunil Chetri. <laughs> I wish. Uh, even if I can be half the player he is, I'll be really, really proud. It's amazing what he has done for the country. Okay, you have some uh, some uh, a love from a guy like. Thank you, my brother. FIFA boy, Malser. Thank. Bro, yes. Okay, Triman is in uh, Minerva right now. So if anyone is asking where he is he staying, एक बार हिंदी में बोलो भाई Triman. <laughs> Um, Hindi banu, thori dekhte hain baat kaun se, par thori bhot yahan diya. Look, um, Pan- he, is, he, he, he speaks Punjabi. <laughs> you know the thing is, Punjabi and Hindi are so similar. That's why I speak Punjabi instead of Hindi. That's why I find it difficult. Imagine it was a bit different. I could have spoken it, but Punjabi uh, any day, any time. Okay, someone asked, have you any kind of uh, interaction with Igor match? I personally haven't. Okay. Okay, any good question? Good question. Okay, someone asked if uh, maybe you can answer this one. Are there other players who want to come to India in Belgium? Other players who want to come to India in Belgium. The, I mean, I look, I've been playing in Belgium and in Europe for like almost eight, seven years. I haven't seen any Indian player playing. I mean, there could have been better, there are better players, I mean, but uh, from my experience, I'm playing against or playing with, I never played with any Indians in my team. So I don't know. I don't think so. I'm the only one. I, I mean, the only one that's playing. So I mean, yeah. If you really 
I mean, okay, the most someone Indian asked players, like, yeah. someone I mean, asked very Indian people in uh, Europe. They are focused on studies more than football or other things. So that's the thing. Yeah, that that's right. Okay, someone asked very good, sensible question. You can answer this one only. <laughs> Freeman, if you really follow Indian football, tell me three good things you will bring in the Indian national team, uh, Indian team. Um, first of all, quality-wise, ex except quality-wise, just coming here to India will um, start a conversation with this one thing, and a lot of a lot of people will watch and take an example from me. Even though I imagine I don't make it, but after me, other people take example for me. That alone is I done enough for Indian football. And more than any other foreign player from uh, for India than ever has done before. So, I mean, uh, just talking about this and now what we are doing now is also a really big thing. And just making the AFFF talking about this and um, just to setting example is the biggest thing. And from playing a part, I think um, at this moment I'm still young and I have to learn a lot. And um, I don't think I, if I get in a national, big national team, uh, senior guys, I'll, I don't have like I'm European. I'm gonna show everybody i'm of course going to show my talent and my potential but i'll be learning from the guys who have more experience than me that know better than me so i'll be respectful i'm not <laughs> going to come i'm from i'm from europe i'm going to show everybody what i am of course i am but not in a naive way you know what i mean so um yeah of course i'll be even if i can be half the player like everybody says you the next one chat if i can be half what he is i'll be really proud of myself and it's a dream come true okay asis has one question Reman sir, my question is the Belgium, what they do to build a strong grassroots level football? I'm, uh, they have really good pitches in every village, uh, every, you, multiple. So there's a thing in Belgium only, which is the size of Punjab. They have more uh, artificial grounds than whole of India does. How Ranjit Pachaj? I think uh, Triman has already answered this question. Ki how Ranjit Bajaj is helping him. Uh, and coming back to uh, uh, Shish question, also um, things that are common sense in uh, for us in Europe are sometimes you have to really tell the players here, which I think is normal. They don't do. Um, um, yeah, I mean, especially taking it intelligence-wise, uh, it's a bit lacking. Mainly scoring goals is also an issue I see, but yeah, that's the thing. Why don't you apply? Pro, he, uh, Triman doesn't have passport, that's why he cannot apply for I League and I League 2. <coughs> Your views. भाई सेम सेम क्वेश्चन मत पूछो थोड़ा अलग अलग भी पूछो ताकि है ना वो थोड़ा चेंज भी लगे बड़े बड़े शहरों में छोटी 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 मोटी बातें होती है अच्छा हाँ सही है भाई त्रिमान भाई कौन से पोजीशन में प्ले करते हैं आई प्ले स्ट्राइकर मोस्टली सेंटर स्ट्राइकर एंड आल्सो कैन प्ले ऑन द विंग Also, the last time uh, you made a video about that Jan Danda situation, and um, a lot of people were you talked about me in the video. My, I didn't know that. I was just um, going to Anandpur Sahib, uh, the Gurdwara, and my phone started boom, 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 getting a lot of messages, screenshots from people that saying, "Look, he talked about you." And my phone exploded. Then I saw the full video. Yeah, and it was just uh, <laughs> great. Your comments also. I want to thank you in, uh, in this person. So yeah, thank you for that. ओके प्लीज अच्छे क्वेश्चंस पूछ लो तो है ना आपका भी फायदा हमारे ही फायदा हो जाएगा प्लीज भाई कुछ अच्छे क्वेश्चंस पूछ लो देखो अभी सेम सेम क्वेश्चंस पूछे इन बेल्जियम डज एनीबडी नोस व्हाट नथिंग नथिंग Uh, okay, lots of people are sending supporting messages. Uh, which is your favorite ISL club? 
Mm, but I like a lot of clubs. I don't have really one specific one, but I, I like I said before, I like Killer Blasters mainly because the fan base, which I uh, really like. Um, I think now around the Punjab because I am from Punjab itself, and I'm also Punjabi, and not, I think it's the only club from North in the ISL. I'm not sure, but I think that's true. So also reason I support them, and they're going to be the underdog this season. Which is also uh, really cool to see. So yeah, that are the two main things uh, teams I like. Okay, one uh, one one good question is there. Have you analyzed yourself against the Indian under twenty players? I um, haven't played that. The only player I've met from that team is uh, Manchu Jangra. I met him in person. And I sat down with him and he just gave me motivation and explained me uh, how Indian football works. Uh, we talked for like an hour, arranged by Ranjit sir. So yeah, that was uh, some insight I got from him. But I haven't been able to play or train with those players yet. Okay, bhai, or koi acha sawal puchna chahta ho to bhai bata do. Triman, do you like uh, position based or counter attacking football? <laughs> Mm, I think it doesn't matter fighting. It's mainly what the coach thinks is better, and I'll have to adapt. But from my opinion, maybe a possession based. <coughs> I think the more okay. touches you get on the ball, the more confident you are as a team and as a player. So I think possession based football is more attractive and better for you as a player to improve. So I think possession based. Okay, Anubhav asked a question. What is the key difference, Riman, regarding tactics you observe compared to Indian ecosystem? So I think he's comparing uh, Belgium and Indian uh, tactics. Exactly. Um, here, the tactics are things that for us are really common. Um, like the things you here explained are things we don't even have to explain to our players. And um, yeah, I mean, I haven't played games yet, so I don't know what tactics they really use. So I don't want to sit here and just say nonsense so i'm going to be really honest i haven't played a game yet I, and i played one game which i played 10 minutes just uh, it was my first day um, with the team so it was just like um, getting the game in so yeah technically i think mostly they're focused on pressing which is much different than we do i think honestly our pressing way is much more efficient but yeah i think what works for the team does work so yeah um, i can't complain How many training sessions? I mean, the training session, the main difference is we do more possession based training, which we haven't done really. Um, they do like a rondo, and the, um, then we do like uh, two, two, three teams of five, and then one team presses, and then the other two teams are one team. That kind of the basic things, actually. And just possession, and then we do game and finishing, and uh, that we don't do as often. I don't think we have done as co good possession based training here. Than we do in Belgium or Holland. They really enjoy the possession base. It's like really fun and it's also really good for you. And I think it's the best exercise you can do for the collectively as a team. Okay, what is the ex what is the exact problem getting Indian citizenship? Why ye to bata diya waise unhone? थोड़ा सा ये हमारा सेशन जो था उसके स्टार्टिंग में इस चीज का आंसर दिया था तो आप वहां पर देख सकते हैं ही कैन जस्ट टेक अ लुक एट माय ट्वीट आई मेड अ ट्वीट ऑन माय ट्विटर टीम ऑन रणवीर 9 आई थिंक इट इज एंड आई जस्ट मेक अ होल थ्रेड स्पीकिंग अबाउट अ सिचुएशन व्हिच आई थिंक तनराज भाई हैज आल्सो कोटेड ऑन हिज पेज सो आई एक्सप्लेन एवरीथिंग जस्ट क्लियरली ऑन दैट व्हाट इज और कोई अच्छा क्वेश्चन हो तो पूछ लो भाई फिर बार बार तो हम बात करते नहीं है वैसे भी मोस्टली सपोर्ट क्वेश्चन इज सर मोस्टली सपोर्ट ओके अदर देन केरल ब्लास्टर्स एनी अदर क्लब अप्रोच यू नो दैट कैन नॉट येट आई मीन नो दैट कैन डिस्क्लोज येट आई मीन आई डोंट लाइक लेट्स कीप इट एट दैट या I'm working on that. I'm just focused on my training at this moment. I mean, without the pastor, it's not very much of use. Only the Lions League, and I'm waiting to see which club does the best. And um, 
is going to the next gen cup so imagine i signed with kayla imagine i would have been able to go to england because they are already knocked out so in a sense it's a yeah it's, i think um i got saved um because of that it wouldn't have a point and where i would have been going home after four or five games because i could have stayed until end of the season and if i stayed the season was ended in like four games so yeah in a sense um i got uh How long do you think you will be getting a passport? It's up to the government. I think um, if I uh, I won't be doing it the normal way because that's going to take too long. And I, who has that much time? And I think if they mess this up, not a lot of players going to want to come to uh, Indians unless they change the rule. And if I go away and they change the rule, then it's all because of me. <laughs> so that, I mean, just start, starting the conversation is just the most important thing, which I did and um, which I'm glad I did. So this is a personal question. I think uh, which one? Show me. Okay, this one. Who's your inspiration? Um, Indian wise or like um, generally? You can answer in like one from like overall one European or something and one Indian. Um, the player that um, made me enjoy football and just start watching football and wanted to play and just watching his, you know, already watching his highlights before the game was just motivation to play was Neymar Jr. Watching his highlights and playing the game and trying to replicate his skills, which mostly didn't work out when I was younger. So I really enjoyed watching Neymar and internationally um, before also, I really like Messi watching him for Argentina has also, also always been um, my... Uh, biggest uh, inspiration and he's the goat of course Messi and um, um, yeah and I think for India lately I've been um, really supporting Sunil Chetri and uh, mainly because I saw one time one time a video of him and saying um, people please come watch the games and just he really wants the betterment of Indian football just watch our games we'll do better we work hard in training just come and support us and um, yeah I think uh, he just really wants to do the best and uh, and he's an inspiration for the country. So I really look up to Sunil Chetri. Okay, bhai. Or any question? Or to tell me. Imagine you are in inter Indian team. What did you do for your player or teach them that you learned in Belgium? I mean, first of all, I have to be in the national team to see if there's something wrong or if there's nothing wrong. I mean, probably are gonna there are a few things that could improve. I mean, it's especially just scoring goals. I think that's the main issue. I mean, in India, there's really lack of goal scoring. I mean, after Sunil Chetri, I mean, in the current team, there are not players that have the that much goals. I mean, and um, and I don't see any player scoring more or at least same the goals that Sunil Chetri has. So I mean, really, goal scoring has the, been the issue. I think um, just our tactical um, attacking tactical uh, intelligence. भाई कई लोग जो इंग्लिश नहीं समझ पा रहे मैं बताना चाहूँगा कि त्रिमान भाई को जो प्रॉब्लम थी वो पासपोर्ट की प्रॉब्लम थी उनको ऑफिस से ऑफिस में भेजा जा रहा है और बोल रहे हैं कि आपको बहुत टाइम लगेगा बहुत टाइम लगेगा तो अभी लेट सी कि क्या हम कितनी मदद कर सकते हैं उनके पासपोर्ट को लेने में और हम कितना पुश कर सकते हैं है ना कि ऑल इंडिया फुटबॉल फेडरेशन के साइड से कितना किया जा सकता है ये सब चीजें अब हम सबके ऊपर है तभी एक वो चेंज जो है ना कि एक इंडियन ओरिजिन का प्लेयर इंडिया आके पासपोर्ट लेता है वो चेंज बदलाव आ सकता है बाकी बाकी देखा जाएगा अभी बस यही बात हो रही है ठीक है तो आप पूरी कन्वर्सेशन को बाद में फिर से सुन सकते हैं जो बातें हुई है ये लाइव खत्म होने के बाद तो आपको काफी चीजें समझ में आ जाएगी क्या क्या बातें हुई है अभी जस्ट हम क्वेश्चन आंसर सेशन कर रहे हैं ताकि अगर किसी so को योर वाईफाई इज इन वर्किंग दैट वन योर ओके योर फ्रोजन यस बेटर नाउ ओके यस आई मीन इट वाज यस आई सी यू नाउ Okay, yeah, this this answer this one. How did your friends and teammates react to your decision to leave Belgium for India? Um, 
Yeah, it was uh, actually first of all it was a really good question. It's much different than the others. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean my my friends. Um, yeah, they understood. I explained them, and um, mo- the most close friends I have, they've always been by my side, and um, I always um, share with them uh, what I'm thinking and uh, get their opinions. So they have been supporting me, and um, yeah, I mean it was really difficult leaving Belgium, the country you c- can imagine where you lived your whole life and uh, grew up leaving for in the country you're almost you know you're from but you almost never been i think i'll come before this i came like eight years ago before the first time I came to maneuver of course so yeah it was um they were also shocked and uh, some people just said i should stay in europe but i think i made the right choice um only if the government really helps me and um yeah uh, they were surprised to say the least Uh, have you had any conversation with Joseph Roma? I don't know who that is. <laughs> who is that? My <laughs> question is, who is Joseph Roma? He is a Belgian guy. Who is Joseph Roma? Joseph Roma, I don't know. Some... He has asked a question. Who is Joseph Roma? I don't know who that is. Oh, is that um, is that the coach of um, Mohan Bagan? Yes, I guess. The... Bye, Batado. Did, did he say yes? Is it the reserve team coach? I think uh, I know who he is. Coach of Mohan Bagan youth team. Yes, yes, I remember. Yeah, I've um, spoken with him once, yeah. A few times actually, yeah, just on over messages because a lot of people um, send me his ID and message him, message him, and I think I send him a follow request and then he followed me back and we just start uh, talking a bit. And that's all I, uh, you know, and I can say we just talked a bit. He's aware of my existence. He is. Or, <laughs> bhai, question of the bolzo. Abhi aapke pas time hai. Uh, उनको केरल ब्लास्टर्स से ऑफर आ चुका है एक बार और अराता इजुमी जो क्वेश्चन पूछ रहे भाई की हेल्प कौन कर रहा है तो अराता इजुमी के साथ बात हुई है उनकी और उन्होंने कहा है कि भाई दिस इज प्रोसेस बता दिया है ठीक है डू यू हैव क्लियर प्लान फॉर योर नेक्स्ट टू इयर्स अम आई हैव अ विजन बट आई डोंट हैव अ प्लान व्हिच इज आउट ऑफ माय कंट्रोल लाइक आई सेड विदाउट अ पासपोर्ट I don't know, so it, I have to see what the password has, and then I have a, I have a vision. I don't have a plan yet. It's all um, up to the password. It's not in my control. If everything would have been in my control, it would have been easy, which it isn't, um, sadly. But <laughs> I just have to um, wait and see what the future holds for me, and I'll just do my best. Yeah. For, okay. Now, what was? उनके पेरेंट्स ने सपोर्ट किया था हमको उनके पेरेंट्स ने ही समवन इज आस्किंग हाउ वाज योर हाउ वाज योर पेरेंट्स रिएक्शन माय फादर देयर वाज नो रिएक्शन बिकॉज़ ही वाज आल्सो ऑलवेज बाय माय साइड लाइक आई सेड इन मल्टीपल इंटरव्यूज एंड ही आल्सो बीन इन अ इंटरव्यू अ फ्यू टाइम्स आई थिंक ट्वाइस एंड या लाइक वी आर लाइक वन पर्सन वी हैव द सेम मेंटालिटी विद विद फुटबॉल वी थिंक द सेम एंड Yeah, he always been by my side, and so he wasn't surprised or anything. I didn't even to tell him he was a person before I even wanted to come to. He said you should go, so he was always um, with me and supporting me. And he just left yesterday, um, back to Belgium. Now I'm alone here. It was a difficult moment, a lot of tears. <laughs> even my father also. I've always been with him, but yeah, I'm always thankful for him. And um, yeah, and, uh, he's he will be supporting me from Belgium, eight thousand uh, kilometers away. But, uh, I know he's always here when I need him. India. Okay, so I think we have taken lots of questions already. Okay, people are asking the same question again and again. <laughs> Show, show like, some, show some, uh, show some support well, messages. I, I don't want uh, anybody that messaging. I don't. I want to show my appreciation to everybody. Oh, 
okay this one is your personal rate your stats like dribbling finishing passing <laughs> Look, um, it depends who you compare it with. If you compare it with Messi, it's going to be much lower. But it, I mean, it has to, you have to compare it with somebody. You know what I mean? So it's a difficult question. But I think my qualities are, especially I just tested also in my finishing session uh, in the first time in like a month, maybe longer, a really long time. And it was, it was looking good. I mean, compared to other players, I was doing reasonably well that are, are senior players here. So my finishing, I would say, is really good. Uh, my fitness can be better because I haven't trained a while, but I think my finishing is uh, solid. I'm not the fastest, but I'm re reasonably quick and I can run a past defenders, but I'm not the most fast player in the world. But um, yeah, I think I have a really good dribble also and uh, my vision is also um, with me. So I, I think I have the qualities um, to become a good striker in Indian football. I just have to make my body, but uh, I'm working on my fitness of my body. But yeah, that will come with age. हाँ भाई वो चार मतलब अगर नेक्स्ट जनरेशन कप में अगर कोई टीम जाएगी तो ही ही कैन साइन फॉर देम एज अ ओसीआई होल्डर यस व्हिच टीम्स यू थिंक आर गोना गेट टू द नेक्स्ट जन कप विच ऑनेस्टली मी राइट नाउ एटी के मोहन बगान इज परफॉर्मिंग वेरी वेल एटी के मोहन बगान रिजर्व एंड केरला ब्लास्टर्स इज देयर दे आर आउट एंड मे बी टू टू एंड थर्ड कैन बी आई थिंक बेंगलुरु या बाय हाय बेंगलुरु कॉज लास्ट टाइम दे आल्सो पार्टिसिपेटेड या केरला ब्लास्टर्स आर नॉट गोना दे दे आर आउट केरला ब्लास्टर्स रिजर्व आर आउट I haven't made past the Kerala district. So. Okay, they okay. So Mohan, Mohan, ATK, Mohan Bagan, because they have like good players, Nasiri and other players from the senior team. Ah, huh, visit Kolkata Derby. So, are you planning to visit Kolkata Derby? Mm, uh, I haven't thought about it. It's really far, <laughs> and uh, I haven't. Um, I mean, I'm really focused on my training. I think that's the most important thing instead of just watching games for vibes. So, I mean, uh, I would love to watch my cell game next season. Maybe even play in it. Um, that uh, <laughs> rather play than watch. So yeah, I mean, uh, I really need to uh, just focus on my training at the moment. That's where my priorities lay. So uh, we will be happy to see you in on pitch in Kolkata Derby, not in the stands. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm, people are gonna say you have to be training. What are you doing? You're watching the game. I just I really want to be on the pitch. Okay, someone pra praises you. Uh, he saw your video highlights. Thank you, bro. Thank you. I would recommend everybody to go to my channel and watch my highlights and. Uh, Also, um, yeah, on my Instagram, I also keep uh, everybody updated about my past situation on my Twitter, and um, yeah, I'll uh, share it. Tanraj uh, and me will uh, make a shared post about the past situation, and um, I will ask everybody to repost that one and just uh, also send a mail, like he said, and make he will make a template which we could share, and just uh, blow their email <laughs> inbox. Okay, okay, okay. So. Sign for. Okay, so I think now nobody is asking questions. Just. I think it's fine. Okay, one question is there from beginning: Messi or Ronaldo? <laughs> I answer it on Messi. Okay, they are asking again and again. Messi, Messi, hundred percent. I don't understand the people that think Ronaldo is good. In my opinion, who's your goat, Messi or Ronaldo? What do you think? Man, <laughs> when I was a kid, I I'm just watching Ronaldo, so I cannot go against him. <laughs> I mean, after World Cup, there's no discussion anymore. I think. ठीक है भाई अब तो कोई पूछ नहीं रहा है तो फिर इंडिया
many foreign players say that Indian team lack in tactics. What is your opinion about that? They do. Attacking, attacking mostly. The thing it's mostly like I said, grassroots. Even like if you say I'm European, I'm gonna have a big impact. The coach is also European. He's played World Cup. He's a bronze medalist. Mm -hmm. He's also European, and he, he's probably gonna have much more impact than me. He's the coach of the team. I mean, it's not just you. Europeans gonna come and everything is gonna change. I'll probably need five, six, seven European players to have a big impact on the team to make it top seventy. And um, it's mostly grassroots. European is just more better. Uh, they invest more money in football. That's the main thing. I don't see the government so much supporting Indian football. That's the main thing. Okay, one personal question. What you love in India? Food, Punjabi food. According to you, how can Indian players improve in basics in football? Training. I think it doesn't matter if you're Indian, if you're Austrian or anything. I think you just have to train. Just um, do the basic instead of doing advanced things, which I don't think is necessary. I think if you get down the basics and you go from there and just improve on everything. I mean, and uh, I see people here doing more advanced, like we were doing a finishing session. It was just going straight from like uh, edge of the 16, like a far post. I think maybe start from a central area, just like one touch finishing doing the basic, which you're going to have more city game situations. Instead of for training on free kicks, do like a, like a f finishing from a cross or something like you're going to be more uh, getting in the game. I think train more game style and doing things that are going to be having more often and your basics passing. I think control and pass is underrated if you got that. And I mean, that's what you're going to be doing 99% of the game with the ball, I think. And you're going to forget the other 88 minutes where you don't even have the ball. So I think that are the most important things. And then instead trading on fin uh, like weird stuff, I see people doing weird stuff, man. It's like a far corner finishing, which how much you how much are you going to do that? And also that has a bit of luck with it also. So I think you should train with uh, things that are going to be in your control, like finishing edge of the box and doing that uh, clinically. So that's what I think is um, the main thing. Train more game realistic. Okay, so I think we had taken all the questions, uh, all the sensible questions. And I think now <laughs> we just have supporting comments, like stay strong, we are with you. We will share like everything they are saying. Yeah. Okay, so uh, it was good talking to you because we just wanted to know what actually is going on. So we, uh, so everyone now, uh, understand the situation what is going on with you and definitely they will support you and all people are with you i, I hope yes i would like to thank everybody and um, keep supporting me i really enjoy and i really appreciate everybody to keep updated with my career follow me on instagram prima uh, seven and on my twitter prima nine and um, we and uh, Tanraj we will make a shared post and uh, we will keep you updated about the pastor situation and i, I want to thank everybody and uh, Thank you, everybody. Okay. okay, thank you so much for joining. Okay, so if you want to go, you can leave. I'll... Sure, sure. Okay. Thank, thank you, everybody. You, thank Have you a nice so day. Much. Yeah. Ha, bhai. So, ab bolo, ab, ab bolo, aapke kya sawal hai? Aur kya aap aur baate karna chahte ho? बात समझ में आ गई होगी सभी को भाई कि अभी जो त्रिमान रणवीर भाई है थोड़ी प्रॉब्लम में है तो हम एक क्या बोलेंगे एक एक ट्वीट करते हैं जिसको आपको रिट्वीट करना है जो भी करना आप कर लीजिएगा और एक ईमेल मैं बनाता हूं ठीक है एक ईमेल बनाता हूं और ईमेल को कॉपी करके मैं कम्युनिटी पोस्ट मार दूंगा और उस ईमेल को आपको कॉपी करना है ठीक है और या आपको जो लगता है आप ऐसा करो या मैं करता हूं कि एक ईमेल बनाता हूं उसको कॉपी करके पेस्ट कर दूं कम्युनिटी पोस्ट में उसको आपको सबको एएफएफ को मेल करना है कि हेल्प करना है त्रिमान रणवीर की उसके पासपोर्ट लेने में और देखिए यहां पे मैं फिर से क्लियर करना चाहता हूं कि कई लोग अगर जो ऐसा बोलेंगे ना कि 
पीआर 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 की त्रिमान रणवीर की पीआर तो ऐसा बिल्कुल मत समझना देखो वो अभी इंडिया टीम से खेलेगा कि नहीं वो हम उसके पीछे नहीं बात कर रहे हम ये बात कर रहे हैं कि वो इंडिया में खेलना चाहता है इंडिया का पासपोर्ट लेना चाहता है तो उसमें हेल्प कर रहे हैं कि कोई अगर इंडिया आना चाहता है कोई है ना ओरिजिन वाला प्लेयर तो वो इंडिया आए मस्त पासपोर्ट ले सकता है कि नहीं इसके ऊपर हम बात करना चाहते हैं ठीक है तो बाकी का हम बाद में देखेंगे फिर फिर वो इंडिया के लिए खेलता है नहीं खेलता वो एक अलग डिफरेंट चीज है ठीक है तो ये मैं कहना चाहता हूँ आपसे तो आई होप कि आप जो है वो आ, मतलब कि इस चीज में हेल्प करेंगे ठीक है तो चलिए फिर बाकी हम शाम को मिलते हैं आई एस अपना हीरो सुपर कप का मैच देखेंगे आईजोल और हैदराबाद का और फिर बाद में उड़ीसा और ईस्ट बंगाल का तो बाकी बातें हम है ना बाद में करते हैं और हाँ त्रिमान रणवीर बिल्कुल भाई ठीक है मुझे कॉल भी आ रहा है यार ठीक है तो फिर हम मिलते हैं बाय बाय ठीक है बाय बाय टेक केयर